Hey guys, what's up? Reach Builds here, and today we're doing another set review on the Carbon Freeze Chamber Set. It is 75137, and that I never was able to build a set, so I thought, hey, if I never built it, then maybe I could try doing a little time lapse. If you guys like it, comment below, but if you know, I might just do what I did with the hover tank. So, let's get started. Yeah, so we finished building that. That was actually really fun to make. Uh, I had no problem at all making this. So let's check out the minifigures, then we can move on to the main set. First up we have Han Solo. Yeah, it's a pretty interesting figure, but like all he has is just a dark brown pants and a t-shirt with a some somewhat worried face or upset that he's going to be in Carbonite. No back torso, and he has a double sided face. Actually, it's a face getting frozen by carbonite. It's actually a very similar face to him getting frozen carbonite, just shown uh, here. See, so it's just literally a little similar, but with the mouth moved a little bit. I like it, it's a very cool figure. And yeah, that's on solo. Next up, we have the Ognot, and he's a very interesting species. What he's basically common in the universe with just being the mechanic or work or just doing something. He's basically just a worker, technically, and just so we can see the torso. Yeah, it's not really exciting, but it's just a basic worker clothes. You can use it for like anything if you just remove the legs or make, if you have a pair of this color legs, just taller, you can make them, you can just put anybody on it or and just replace the head. Overall, I like this figure. It's new and I'm definitely going to use in one of my animations. Last but not least we have the infamous Boba Fett. What I really like about this figure is <laughs> the cape and the jetpack and keeping the Mandalorian mold still going even though I actually liked having the Mandalorians of the Clone Wars. I wish that was still going on but hey this is this is fine for now. But like, he's a very, very interesting figure. Luckily, I have the, the Slave 1 Boba Fett. And there is little to no differences except for the arm prints. But, yeah, it's hot, hidden under this cape. But it's basically the same thing, but in a cheaper way. Just doesn't have the arm prints. And a different expression from it as well. We have just the happy face, and in this one we just have a angry. Oh. Yeah. So yeah, there's not really a difference, and it's just that it looks like they're just gonna keep this version of um, Boba Fett um, for a pretty for a long time. Like he's gonna be in a lot of 2017 sets. One, one second. Let me just take off the jetpack and cape, so we can see. So that's yeah, cool. that's like both of them. The like back torso. A very interesting. Like same thing as what other Mandalorians have, but and how they keep having the the design from the front lead up to the back. Also, he has a really nice. Um, Rifle that not compared to the EE3, but this is a 
good for now. So this is the main build. It's a very, a very interesting build. I'll just spin you around to the back and just give you like a 360 look of it. Yeah. Oh. First feature about it is that it has an elevator. Like you can just have a, someone right there on it and lev levers them up and then you can just do that. Go just like down. Um, for the main feature is that this spins with a new piece right here. Yeah, it's... First I didn't know what that was until I noticed. I'm like, oh, okay, that's a new piece. And then you have a, a printed tile right there for the communication for Han Solo. Like, well, just like to press it for him to get carbonated. Carbon freezed. Damn. All right. So, and then what you can actually do is you can bring this down, spin it around, and then put Han Solo in there. I already have Han Solo in there just so I could save time and don't have to see me fail continuously, squeezing him in. And then he goes spinning around like that. <laughs> Whatever you could do. And also, this is this can be removed. Or you can just have Han Solo right there as well. And but I like to keep it on that, so it looks good. Then you get your Yagnot guy. Whatever, and stick him right there. Have fun with messing with Han Solo. Then you have, you can just have Boba Fett right there. Yeah, so let's check out the box and then that's it. So this is the box, there's the four figures. I ever got to do Han Solo, but, and Carbonite, but that's fine. Showed off in the build. There's all the play features and yeah. That's the end of this review. If you like it, please comment and subscribe. And happy holidays. Bye.